The Biden administration is taking steps to make affordable quality mental health care available to more Oklahomans. New regulations announced today would force health insurance providers to take a hard look at their mental health coverage. Our Washington Bureau Chief Alex Cameron has the details. Back in 2008, Congress passed and then President Bush signed the Mental Health Parity and Addiction Equity Act, requiring that the level of care your health plan offers for mental health be at least the same, if not better, than the care it offers for physical health. Today's rule is really focused on taking the next step. And that next step, says presidential health advisor Kristen Young, is addressing the challenges that have allowed many health insurance providers to be out of compliance with the parity law. It's more than twice as likely that people are seeing out-of-network care uh, when it comes to mental health as compared to physical health. Most significantly, the rule would force insurance companies to conduct an analysis of their health outcomes. And if they're not at parity, if mental health care is harder to access than physical health care services under the terms of their plan, then, then insurance companies are going to have to make changes. We have a mental health crisis on our hands right now. Congresswoman Stephanie Bice hasn't studied the proposed rule yet, but believes part of the solution has to be increasing the overall number of mental health professionals. You, um, you know, can ask Oklahomans that have tried to seek mental health treatment. It is weeks or months before they can get in to see um, a therapist or a counselor. And if you're in a crisis situation, that's not acceptable. We know we need to do more. Uh, we know we, we need to, to take action to really get health plans into compliance with, with the law. And this rule is, is a critical first step. Our young couldn't give a precise timeline on when the rule would take effect, but the process begins with a 60-day public comment period. In our Washington Bureau, I'm Oklahoma's own Alex Cameron.